All right, I am back. <clears throat> we are now at 75% on all of the available metrics, aside from, of course, the Golden Gate. And we are starting in on the west side of the island with this pretty cool looking tower. Let's take our screenshot, our customer screenshot, and we have to be able to talk to you who are invading our expedition. Nice to be outside the city, isn't it? It's a myth, it's a symbol, but mostly it's just a goal. Holistic, tech-assisted, communal utopia. I'd settle for nudging the needle. Not totally implausible. I wouldn't be able to resist taking a look. Given Byron's disappearance and the political struggles surrounding the Somnidrome, it seemed logical to adjust my priorities. We respected each other and I supported him. We had our philosophical differences, of course. He placed much greater emphasis on the individual than I did, but overall, I think he was our best bet. Still is, I hope. That's because I find such conversations boring. I can tell. What can I do for you, 1K? As a journalist, I think the line between speculation and disinformation is too thin for me to engage in guessing games. It's a complex issue, and I think it should be left to experts. I believe that journalism serves an important function in our society, and I'm dedicated to reporting the truth with accountability and responsibility. It means understanding that I can't just publish things without considering their impact. Serious disruptions to the social fabric of New Jerusalem could endanger lives. That's not journalism anymore. Huh. All right. Is this a, uh, this is just like a, this is just like a thing. First puzzle in the west. We have Servitor. I don't know what that means. We have something pretty. Weird. Okay, so it travels along this. So that was in the way. about the goal and the theory of everything is the past what we thought it was is the future what we want it to be but the only thing that's real at the end of the day is the present and right now what matters is that our friend is lost and needs our help agreed I 
Alright. Puzzle number two. Supportive apparatus. And goal is red laser here. from his prison, like so. over here. Since it's so close to the fence, it'll be able to just barely reach over. Yep. Alright, pretty cool, pretty cool. Although these are pretty functionally similar to the blue little things in the original game that would like zap you if they hit you. They're a bit different, obviously, since you can power them to things on their heads, but it just reminds me of them at least.
<laughs> Moron. Whoa. Cool. Okay, puzzle number three. Automatic doors. goes over the barrier. Let me out. Okay. All right. They're constantly over there. Wait, what do you say? It's all starting to make sense, kind of. <coughs> that we could use it safely, which I doubt. Does that mean that we should? Is it right for us to dominate the world? We value our own freedom. Should we not also value the freedom of all the living things with which we share this planet? Not now. Let's have this conversation at another time. You still have a lot to do. Better get to it. Um, no. <laughs> How about no? What can I do for you, 1K? My chief aide, Jeremy, is in charge for now. It's good practice for him, in case he decides to run for office one day. Cornelius is responsible for many innovations. He helped create the designs for the upgraded body you inhabit. Although the founder chose to remain in yeah. her original configuration. But in recent years, he had settled into a life of quiet scholarship. Or so it seemed. That's why Athena had those different feet. She's still it's the old always model. a pleasure to speak to a citizen. Oh, screw this guy. Oh my god. What is this? It's huge things. Trevor!
How is this supposed to work? The system is meant to last centuries. Centuries! And yeah, Chernyshevsky's plan, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. But I'm working with hardware that was deliberately designed to fail. Planned obsolescence, baby. Selling broken garbage just to make another buck. A buck you can't even spend because in a few more weeks, we'll be extinct. Was it worth it? That's the part that Alexandra doesn't see. The greed, the stupidity, the selfishness, the way that we created this whole situation in the first place. She wants you to be like us, but if you ask me, there's a whole lot of human history and behavior you can just throw away, <laughs> chuck it in the trash, right? Yes. You have a chance at a fresh start. Make the best of it. Trevor's a real one, though. Jailbreak. Puzzle number... Oh, sorry. This is a lost puzzle in the area. And boy, it looks weird. So, end result. Get the dude all the way down here. Jump on it. Everything needs to stay open the whole time to power, I guess. So we can have it wait there. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> oh wait, I can make it come back. Okay. That's fine, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, can you just wait there for a second? <laughs> Let's see if back
Okay, I don't know. Very slightly further. I guess I can just have it move further like this. And that is hopefully enough. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, that one was kind of kind of cool. I like that one. Like your your connector was still trapped, but you still had to use it. From within. Tell me, Yakut, what impact do you think the megastructure will have on the future of this island? It depends on what we do with it. Miranda used it to spread life, to make things better. We can do the same. And yet, poor Miranda lost her own life doing so. She just made a mistake. She couldn't wait to show everyone what they discovered. We can be more careful. I really like you, Coot. Seems like a solid guy. Okay, listen, I wanted to ask you something. From your perspective, as someone who's still new to our society, do you think New Jerusalem betrayed Athena? A little. Well, I don't know, I feel like she could have also done more to avoid what happened. That's true, but she was more than a leader. She wasn't a politician like Herman. She gave everything she had for us. When I think about the state New Jerusalem is in, he's put us all in danger. I don't know if he really believes in the goal, or if it's just a convenient myth, but I don't care. This is not how you build a living civilization. Bang, bang. I don't know. I suspect he's around here somewhere, biding his time. But what he's waiting for, not a clue. Yes, of course it is. Okay. I'd like to help make New Jerusalem the city it was meant to be. And then, I'd like to help build new cities. On Earth and up there, too. Cities nobody's ever imagined before. Because there's no effort involved. Building a better world means taking responsibility. It means making choices and living with their consequences. Surrendering to nature is just letting go. Fair enough. You know, when I decided that we should call ourselves human, I did that because it seemed like a powerful symbol of our continuity. But the truth is, and I'm ashamed to admit this, I thought we were better than them. I thought we understood the value of civilization, and we wouldn't repeat the same mistakes. But the simulation worked too well. We're not just like them. We are them. We really are. But that doesn't have to be a bad thing, Athena. We may have the same flaws, but we also have all the potential they did. Everything that Alexandra Drennan saw in them is also in us. I hope you're right. I really do. All right. <clears throat> 
Puzzle number four. Surfing. So we have a fan cage and some craft. <clears throat> and gold blue laser to there. It's just a fan on the ground. Where's the blue laser source? Infernal contraption. Okay. <laughs> it only went back where it did because it wanted to. Oops. Never. up there? It does. So it doesn't need to be powered anymore. And so we can do this. Cool beans. Pretty cool button. Surfing. <coughs> Surfing in the air. Well done, 1K. And that is a nicely well elevated blue laser or potentially red laser. I believe this was the hidden lab. Wow, big one.
Intelligentsia? growth advanced synthesis This is recent.
Where's this fix? Howdy. Mm, yes, quite. All right, puzzle number five is nuisance.
Oh. Oh. Was that it? Huh. I wonder if that was the intended solution. Excuse me. I was looking at your research log, and I was rather perplexed by the latest upload. Oh, Melville strikes again. Is that your foot, Melville? Yes. Do you want to see it up close? Although you won't be able to fully enjoy it, as you don't have a rear camera. Sorry, <laughs> Mayor. Melville just has a unique way of taking pictures. Next time you're getting an upgrade, you coot. I'm installing a mute button. I mean, I don't really think there's any other way to do it that makes very much sense, at least that I can immediately think of, so I'm really happy with that. Uh, let's see over here. We have the other lost puzzle for this area. It's called Vertical Locomotion. We have a blue little... Do If it were powered, it would bring. Oh! Wait. Oh. <laughs> I, for I forgot about this part. Excuse you, Mr. Sign. is something we choose but I feel like like there's something there something that's been there from the moment I was born maybe even before 
Well, there are many ways of looking at this, and everyone's experience is different, so you'll have to make up your own mind. But I have a little theory, if you'd like to humor your old man. Of course. What is it? The universe is eternal, but it's always lost in a deep, dreamless sleep. You are a tiny little bit of the universe that's suddenly woken up, and you've realized that being awake is better than being asleep. And that gives you a purpose. And what is my purpose? To be, Miranda. Just to be. Oh, I saw this while <coughs> that was playing, and it looks like I've already found where it's located. It looks like this is the orientation of it. No. This. This is definitely okay. Quite easy, and I saw the uh, Prometheus spark thing up there within the next puzzle. So basically, these two stars are busted. What can I do for you? It's possible. I won't trust Prometheus until he actually leads us to Byron, but yeah, seems likely. But even if it is a myth, that doesn't mean we can just abandon it. Myths can contain elements of truth, and I think this one exists for a reason. Maybe we had to create this imaginary founder because the real one lost her way. It's the only way I can explain what she's built here. She got wrapped up in her ideas and lost all sense of perspective. People have thought they understood everything before. Obviously, Athena has unlocked tremendous powers, but forgive me if I'm skeptical that her theory really encompasses everything. Not just our ability to know, but our need to know. More equations aren't going to make us any happier. Byron couldn't stand it. Have you ever tried asking the mayor a difficult question, he used to say? But I think he does an all right job, to be honest. I try to stay out of their circuits, and they try to stay out of mine. Helga is an old friend, but the others, they're not my crowd. He's smarter than people give him credit for. There's more to some folks than meets the eye, you know. If you say so, I can't stand the dude. Alright, star number 19. In times of war, is it wisdom or folly to give a sword to a child? Gotta say, sounds like folly. So can I just climb this fish? Alright, puzzle number six. Elements. Elements. Give it to me. Go through. It's really not right. No, it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Why do we have to? Does it need? Do they need to stack underneath of each other to?
feels like this can only... Oh, it can reach. Okay. Kinda feels like that might not be intended to happen, but even if it weren't... Oh, I could have just connected it to that up there. I don't even know. Just so that. It looks <laughs> Opens the door to the end. Cool, cool. Power is open, but it's only two puzzles. The founder has a remarkable gift for designing these trials, but then she did have to overcome Elohim, whose very purpose was to design trials. So I, I totally understand I didn't have to do it like that. I could have just gotten the red one off of the plate and sent them each in motion and got on top of one while the fan was on. Just the same thing. That was funnier. So same solution, just a slightly different way of doing it. have been accomplished by those who believed in humankind but greater things than these may yet be accomplished by those who uphold the faith
Ich bin dabei. Actually, pretty tricky. Good puzzle. I like it. Very nice. Only 
impressed? Hold one more time. Breach. Cool. Alright, it's fine to talk to you. Hey, can we talk for a second? Sure thing. I'm still struggling. I was really hoping we'd find Miranda alive. Her way of seeing the world was so inspiring. And the idea that I can never get to know her, that she's gone. I guess I've never really been good at dealing with death. Maybe because it's so rare in New Jerusalem, except for pets. And even in that case, I find it very hard to deal with. I still miss my first cat and it's been over a century since she died. When someone dies, it's this void. I know I should just let it go, but some part of me refuses. And I feel like that part, it hurts me, but it also keeps me human. And I know, I know it would be healthier if I said, okay, Miranda is someone I never met. She's just a bunch of glitchy old files. But if I do that, as rational as it seems, it feels like I'm surrendering something, something that matters. I hope so. I can't right now, but maybe I can get there somehow. Anyway, thanks for talking to me, 1K. <laughs> Of course, go ahead. Yeah, you're welcome. But anyway, let's talk about this stuff. I think he's done his best. I don't disrespect him, but I'm not sure he's leading us down the right path. Despite everything that's gone wrong here, I'm not sure we should just reject what the megastructure has to offer. On the one hand, there's so much we could do with the theory of everything so many lives I could live. I have enough ideas for the next, I don't know, 20,000 years, easily. And that's just from five minutes of thinking about it. On the other hand, Miranda's gone. So much hope, so much grief. I don't know how to, how to balance that. I hear he escaped Pellegrino and peed all over Melville's workshop, so apparently he's doing great. I miss him, though. I always feel like the fact that he likes me is a huge compliment. Lifts me up somehow. Honestly, I'm not sure how I couldn't see it more clearly before. It doesn't match anything Alexander Drennan believed in, and continuing Drennan's legacy was Athena's whole point. In the ancient year 1969, a band called Mellow Macarin wrote a psychedelic rock song about the Talos Principle. It's called Cretan Bronze Man's Flying Mystery Adventure. You should see the rest of the album. There's a song about a disembodied tongue called the Taste of Your Elbow. It's 15 minutes long and features an improvised tuba solo. I mean, it can't be good. I think you need psychedelics to enjoy it, really. Maybe if you stick your head inside a really large magnet. <laughs> nope, but at least I finally understand why Athena wanted to get out of the simulation so badly. Bro, this guy's such a hater. Alright. Okay, puzzle number eight. Final one of this area. What do you got here? Okay. Uh, what's his name? Yeah. The Frazier. The reason I have always admired Alexandra Drennan 
is that even in death, she fought to see the world as it is, not as she wanted to see it. I say fought, because I believe this is not an easy matter. It is a mental and spiritual struggle that we must undertake with great seriousness, even when we are choking. The ancients believed that for most of us, the world is a shadow cast by a flame, dimly seen on the wall of a cave. Our task is not to interpret these shapes, but to free ourselves from the cave itself. The world we see around us may not always be as it appears. Some philosophers have said that we are surrounded by nothingness, merely because air is not visible to the eye. And yet one needs only to observe the wind in the trees, or to plunge one's hand into the clear waters of the Aegean to see that air has material substance. The same applies to many other forces that shape our lives. That they seem invisible does not mean that they are absent. It only means we have not yet learned how to observe them. And yet, lately I have struggled to understand what I am seeing. This strange, insubstantial island. These machine men. This woman with a fierce voice like an Amazon. Who are they? How did I get here? Huh? Who's that? Weird. Puzzle number eight, last one here. Transference. It's just to be able to see what's going on. Just puzzle done. Oh, is there something up here? It still is, despite the many hesitations. I'll grab this. Okay. Cool puzzle. The glass was strange. For sure. But I mean, definitely needed. 
to be able to see through there. I guess maybe they didn't want us to be able to teleport through that. Um. Okay, so we are pretty much done here. Very close to the Golden Gates being opened, though. Which I'm looking forward to. Absolutely. Oh no! Oh. It's fine. What is that? Oh no, 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 no. Archaeologists find ten human artifacts. Mm -hmm. This Prometheus frame is elusive for sure.
maybe I'll be able to see down from the uh, tower. Aha! Wow, this one is like almost in the ground, it seems like. That one's tough to find. Wow. Okay, number 13. I'm definitely not convinced that I've gotten them all even remotely, considering how there's been two in a few locations. It means there's two in all of them, which would really surprise me given how much I explored the south or at least one in the demo. So, wow, this might be the biggest one yet. like that. This is the last time we will speak, Creature of Clay. Together, we have told the stories of ancient gods and heroes. But the golden ages of the past are distant. The gods have retreated to their high places, and there are no heroes amongst men. In days gone by, I was renowned for my riddles. But you, Creature of Clay, are a riddle without an answer. Let us hope that it is. Farewell, creature of clay. Remember my stories, and do not let the flame burn you. That is an unsettling amount of energy. I would hate to see what would happen if one of those beams was aimed at something else. I was thinking the same thing when we were flying into the megastructure a bunch of those times. Like, apparently, I don't find one of those beams. So, I mean, we can block the small beams with our bodies with the same. to the 
quest too. 